that the opening game of Super Rugby Pacific is just around the corner. The Chiefs taking on the Crusaders, a rematch of last year's final. We get to see it happen in round number one. And the lineups for these two sides have just been announced. Now, there are a lot of changes compared to what we saw in last year's final, mainly for the Crusaders, who have an almost all-new side heading in to this contest. But we will start with the home side, the Chiefs. Their starting lineup is going to be as follows. Number one, Aiden Ross. Number two, Bradley Slater. And number three, it is Ruben O'Neill. So the Chiefs opting to go with Slater in the starting lineup. Have Samasoni Tokiaho close out the match from off the bench. And the lock and Joe is Nato Akoi. And number four, and Tupavai there as the number five. So no Brody Retallick due to him going overseas. Summer Penny Finau at number six. Number seven, Kalen Boshier and number eight. It is the captain of the Chiefs side this year, that being Luke Jacobson. Now the back line, Xavier Rowe, a very talented young player for the Chiefs who's looking to have a standout season here. Number 10, Damian McKenzie. So opting for that fly half rather than fullback for the opening game of Super Rugby Pacific. And I believe that is what the Chiefs will do for a majority of the season as well. Seems like fly half is really where McKenzie sees himself in the future, out on the left wing, it is Itena Nana Satoro, the quick stepper machine, always looking to score those breakaway tries. Quinta Pia in the midfield alongside Anton Leonard Brown. Now, it's been a long road to recovery for Quinta Pia from when he was wearing that All Blacks jersey to this point now. This will be his first full season, fingers crossed, for the Chiefs in quite some time. I do hope he does extremely well. And he's got Anton Leonard Brown on his outside, like I mentioned. So, a lot of stability. A lot of defensive work going to be coming from that Chiefs midfield. Out on the right wing, it is Liam Coombs Fabling, who is a very talented player for Waikato. And then number 15, close out the starting lineup. They have gone with Sean Stevenson off the bench. Samasone Tokiaho, like I mentioned, will be there. And number 16, number 17, Ollie Norris. And then number 18, it is George Dyer. Number 19, Jimmy Tupo, a new name for the 2000. And 24, Super Rugby season. Number 20, Simon Parker. Number 21, Cortez Ratama. 22, Josh Ioani. And number 23, Daniel Rona to close out this home. Chiefs side now looking through at the Crusaders. Like I mentioned, they have got so many changes compared to what we saw throughout last season. But the question is about to be answered. What do the Crusaders look like without Scott Robinson? sitting at the helm. Now we've seen pre-season, which isn't always the best judging factor, but soon we will get to see them in action for the first time. Looking at their lineup, it is number one, George Bauer, number two, George Bell, and number three, the man Mountain, the mighty Williams. Number four, Scott Barrett, he will be the captain for the Crusaders in this game, and then number five, Quinton Strange. So really not too many changes overall. Of course, no Cody Taylor, and the starting lineup here for the Crusaders. And no Sam Whitelock, another player who's missing for them this year. Number six, Dom Gardner. Number seven, Tom Christie. And number eight, it is Cullen Grace, who's had a few injury troubles throughout the last couple years, but is back now for the Crusaders alongside Tom Christie, who's an absolute tackling machine. In the back line, number nine, Mitch Drummond, with number 10, being Reves Rayhana. He is the player who they are looking to shape into the next Richie Mwonga in that 10 jersey. Of course, he's got plenty of years left in his career, Reves Rayhana, and he will be a name to watch out for. And this season, out on the left wing, it is Maka Springer in the midfield, Dallas McLeod alongside Levi Amua, a brilliant signing for the Crusaders, taking him from Moana Pacifica. Number 14, Sevi Reese, who we didn't see too much of throughout last year, and number 15. To close out the Crusaders' starting lineup, it is... Jay Fiaki now off the bench. Quinton McDonald at 16. Number 17, Joe Moody. And number 18, Owen Franks. So they've got a huge amount of experience, huge amount of age in their prop and department. But sometimes in the props, age is wisdom. And these two have got plenty of just that. Number 19, Jamie Hanna. Number 20, Christian Leo Willey. He had a very good last season for Super Rugby Pacific. Number 21, Niall Hotham. Number 22, Taha Kamara. So another young player getting an opportunity for the Crusaders in this opener. And then number 23, another veteran for the Saders. It is going to be Ryan Crotty. But this game kicking off at 7.05 p.m. New Zealand time on the Friday night. Should be an outstanding one and an awesome way to start this Super Rugby Pacific 
2024 competition. Now, we will have live commentary all throughout the Super Rugby Pacific season. This game specifically, I believe I will be at a wedding at the time that it does kick off. So I'm not sure what we're going to do there. But hopefully, we can have some sort of coverage for the game just around the corner. But do let me know what you think of these two lineups. Also, who you think will be walking away with the victory for this first match of the competition. Thank you all very much for tuning in. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. And we'll see you all for the next one.